Watch out, phishing scams have leveled up for 2025. Earlier this year, security firm Fortra observed a highly sophisticated phishing attack in the wild, combining a number of technologies. Now, phishing is nothing new, but how they layered an HTM file with AES uh, encryption calling a content delivery network and a note package manager containing, containing the malicious code is the first time they've seen this in the wild. Now, they've all been observed individually before, but not together to deliver a Microsoft 0365 phishing attack. Now, the abuse of open source repos like NPMs is, well, is a well-known threat to organizations like Roblox a couple of years ago with tokens getting taken. These tactics also allow threat actors to conduct supply chain attacks and now deliver phishing URLs. So it begins with a phishing email containing an HTM file delivered to the victim's inbox. Now, it looks harmless, but beneath the surface, the file includes some encrypted code, which is kind of uncommon in the average phishing attack. So once decrypted, now the AES encryption is used to hide a string stored in the variable. Uh, it, and once decrypted, it points to a URL of a popular CDN known for distributing open source projects and NPM packages. If it's blocked, they go on to the next link. They always do a version check. And with that variable, it captures the user's email address to make the phishing attack look even more authentic and uh, continues on to different URLs to find the appropriate loader. And then when accessed with the correct parameters, this is what the victim would see and a final landing page to collect their Office 365 credentials. Now to defend, obviously user training is important, being vigilant about email attachments for sure. And certainly you can use network telemetry and an observability and defense platform like Plixer One to keep an eye on any new or unusual connections to CDNs or node manager packages out there. I'm Peter with Plixer, like and sub, and be careful.